Hey guys, what's up? So today I want to talk about like... No, I'm not going to be doing an Adventure Time review. Before I start that, yeah, I'm going to be talking about the first Season 9 4 episodes. This is not going to be a full edge review since I'm going to... Uh, I'll be saying this for October. But for now, let's explain what I think about the, all four episodes so far. So what are my thoughts on the walk? Adventure Time... The Walk Isle Hunt was pretty good. I do like the a uh, little more problems. With, is that yeah? Most of the episode was a well, pretty good, and yes, even they do like something. You know, trying to kill the goblins is and with the help of Hunter Wizard, Finn killed the thing. Yeah, I was gonna make a unit for kids show, but also by the way, I'm still not shipping Finn with if. Hunter Wizard, Princess Bubble, Finn and Princess Bubble for life! Okay, yeah, we get it. I know, I'm still shit that because... Oh well, I still ship it though. Only me. Hold on. Anyways, I'll... Anyways, always be more closely. It was also a pretty good episode, and I do like the character development between Bemo and Pr and I mean I Ice King, and it was pretty nice for these two to get some character development. It's not that really kind of the greatest. It's kind of great to see two characters that mm, mostly they hang out. It's pretty great. And though I do like some of the comedy, and yeah, we get to new know who later on. And yeah, Son of Rat Bear is by far one of the. Where this episode to redeem one of my most hated characters in one of my least favorite characters in this show. Flame Princess. And for those wondering why I hate Flame Princess Well there is a reason why. <gasps> she ruined my print Finn and Princess Bubblegum shipping! And yeah, that was one of my least favorite one of my favorite shippings. And yeah, I do like the character development, though. Flame Princess and his father. Yeah, the character though is pretty good. I do like the rap song, even using a butt joke for that one. And I do like the episode. It's pretty much a great redeem from one of my least favorite characters from the show. Flame Princess. Eh, at least we get some character development with her. Though the ending, I kind of sorry I did get come because due to some eh, some video links to yeah. I'm just Anyways, the last episode. The Bond Bubblegum. Bond me Bubblegum. It's kind of a great episode to see some great backstory of Princess Bubblegum and the Ice and the Kingdom. Um, the Grabbles kind of look. It's weird how Grabble most turn into the food punch that I really annoyed for seeing. And it's kind of weird of the origin story. And yes, the origin story is kind of a bit messed up. Though, I hope they mostly. I worry one. I feel like one day that they might get reversed. One day. Also, thank God there's no. Basically telling that, yeah, Princess Bob. When I'm just shipping with. With Marsley. No, I don't ship them! I ship Finn and Princess Bubblegum! Pum. Yeah, that's pretty much why I still ship. I ship them forever! Ever. And ever. And ever. And I hope they don't pray them up. But I hope Prince, well, Princess Bubblegum and Marceline are just friends. I hope they're just friends. Well, what about Power 4? It's not going to be happening that much. And I'm not going to go think about reviewing the Power 4. There are many reasons why I'm not going to review the Power 4. One. It's because I don't feel... The Power of Four was something that I was going to originally tend to review, but... I went... Yeah, when I first saw there was going to be a pri a fourth Princess Bubble... Uh, no, a fourth Bubble Girl? We, yeah, I know they, the original show did something, and... Okay, I don't want to talk about it right now. Okay, actually, I don't feel like talking about it for now. I might talk about it maybe in a separate video. But anyways, I want to talk about October's update. Yeah. October. I'm gonna be doing four October things. Please. I'll be doing. I mean, the first thing I'll be doing is a Rick and Morty season three 
The episode six to t to ten. Yeah, I'll be doing do doing the first. Doing the first four, last five episodes I'll be reviewing the show. Second, in OK actually. Second, I'll be doing an OKKO OK Cro OKKO OK Captain Planet crossover. Yeah, I'll be doing that Captain Planet crossover. This is gonna be a. I'll be doing the Captain Planet crossover. Like, this is gonna be between my Halloween review. Yeah, that crossover is going to be happening whenever the crossover releases. This is my only last excuse I'll be making for this season. Season. I'll be doing that crossover. Like, I'll be promised to do that crossover. Oh yeah, by the way, yes, even I would also notice that it's kind of weird how we, well, also Oh well, yeah, I'm gonna get that crossover done in October. Release date is in October, so I'm just gonna review that. The Halloween episode isn't confirmed, but it's gonna be that Spongebob Halloween that I but it will be these possibly the SpongeBob crossover. The Spo I think the SpongeBob cro actually no actually the SpongeBob Halloween the three D animated version. I'm of course referring to the three D animation version. It's gonna I'll be reviewing that as my Halloween review, and the re I'll be reviewing that yeah if you're wondering it's the stop motion one. I'm going to review the stop motion adaptation for Halloween. And why the stop motion one? Well, it's because obvious. It was per when I I saw the Christmas episode. Ren, yeah, I'll do this for my Halloween review. This is going to be for my Halloween review. Ew. So I don't know when is it confirmed to be released, so I'm thinking maybe like... One sec, when's the release date? Oh. Currently there's... Oh yeah, it's coming out this October. But I will tell... But in the meantime, I might think about doing others. I actually can't think of one I haven't done that. <sighs> oh yeah, by the way, a quick little update with my OKKO OK crossover review. Yes, both the original two out of the other original voice actors for Cat's Planet will do the will do the sh will do their original voice acting. I hope it doesn't. But my best bet, if, oh well, I might see. Yeah, I mean, I will get the Go KKO crossover event review, crossover review, and why the crossover review to be precise. There's are many reasons why I decided to want to pick this crossover. Actually, no, I want to tell why this. I oh, would like to say why this crossover, to be precise. Like one, this is like something I would feel like that. And yeah, even I would like to know why would you want to cross over these two shows? But oh well. Anyways, this is going to be for the Halloween. In 2017 update. So yeah, this is gonna be for part of the October 2017 update. So if you have any questions, I would also probably review something that's a bit Halloween themed another day or two. But also November is gonna be a month where basically Star is gonna return, and that's pretty much it. What I'll be doing for next for November, pretty much. And now time to leave you guys alone and probably eat my my por my porridge. See ya.